Hey guys, we're going to look at how to use a car wash. We'll have a look at the outside of the car in a minute, see what, how filthy it is, and um, then we're going to drive to the car wash. There's different types of car washes you can get. You can get a jet wash, which is obviously using a jet, using it yourself, or you can get one where you just put the money in and drive through it. Uh, what I'm going to use is a semi-automated one where there's going to be people on the front just directing you in, making it a little bit easier. There's going to be a price list there, so we better see that at the same time. And uh, we're going to drive through the car wash, probably take about five minutes going, going through it, so uh, it'll be interesting. Let's see what the car is like on the outside, because I've not cleaned the car for a good few months, so it's probably due a clean. Let's go and see. You can see it might look clean to you actually, but it's actually quite filthy. We get close up, you can see the dirt there, and the wheels are actually quite filthy. If we go to the front one, see that? So yeah, it's due, it's due a good clean the car, and uh, I think it's a good day to do it. Saturday morning, so there's a good chance it's going to be quite busy at the car wash, which is a good thing. So I'm hoping to kind of give you some tips on it. Okay, so let's get going. So we're going to use a car wash, automated one, where they they control it, and there's going to be people there also to clean the outside of the car. I'm going to um, not select the lowest, the lowest, cheapest one, but they're they're quite cheap. Some of them, some can be quite dear. They can even valet your car for you. So um, let's see what it's like. Let's look at the prices. I'll try and talk you through what I'm going to be doing while I'm there. It's probably going to be crowded because it's going to be Saturday morning. People getting the car cleaned, hopefully. And um, we'll see how good things go. It says on it, attendance car wash. The, the one we're going to use. Uh, I think it's a franchise one because I've seen them around in a few places. So I'm, I'm sure they're going to be most places around the UK, if not very similar. So we'll do a left into here. And looks like there's a little queue also, which is fine. which is good because <clears throat> this is what it's normally like when you're when you're out in busy areas um there's going to be a queue and, and if, if you're in the queue to get your car washed it can be quite scary actually being quite close to a car because you feel like you're going to be right to his bumper now a little tip for you before we start going make sure your windows are up if you've got a long aerial make sure you take it off or put it down because you don't want to get broken off and anything loose on the outside turn it off as well so you can pay on this one looks like I'm looking ahead there you can pay cash or debit or credit card I'm just gonna pay on the card and get it out of the way saves and cash I'm gonna put a mask on so if I open the door I'm gonna put a mask on so you've got the basic one 3 99 and then wash one, five pound, wash two, five fifty. So the five fifty one, I'll open this. Does a wax protection, just pulling me forward. Hey, uh, wash number you? two, please. Are you, right, sir? Are, you, are you okay? I'm very good, how are you? I'm fine. Number two? Yes, please. Do you need a VAT or a seat for that? Uh, no, this is a private one for me. Oh, okay. <laughs> <All right. laughs> how you been? Not bad yourself. Have you been working at the mill or not? Not yet, not yet. On the 12th, right? Uh, a week later. Two weeks later. Thank you. Have a nice day. You take care. So they're quite friendly. Take the mask back off. And all they're doing is directing me forward. And they might ask you to go to the left or right. Because if, if, if you if a little gap between the car in front of me happen, there's a little pulley on the, on the right hand side where it's going to pull your wheels through. So you can see the prices there on the on the left. So they do all sorts. Now the the, the actual um, one for 12, 15, 13 pounds is quite a good one actually. Get a good clean. So it's 
pulling me forward. So I'm going to give you another little tip. Once I actually get in place, I'm going to I'm going to be stopping the car, putting it in neutral, turn the engine off. But I'm not taking the keys out. I'll leave the keys in so I don't get the steering lock on, and I'll put the mirrors in. So it's just a little bit of clutch control. He's pulling me forward. Keep an eye on him. It's quite busy. You've got to get yourself in pretty close. Pulling across to the right. Keep an eye on him. Neutral. Mirrors in. Engine off and then just let it do itself. So keep the key in so that your steering doesn't lock. And then just let the machine pull you through. And I say, make sure your windows are up. And you'll feel your steering slightly pulling to the left or pulling to the right, but uh, don't press the brake. If you've got a problem, use your horn. That's what it's there for. So it's, we've been in it now about 30 seconds. It's going to get quite loud, so you might not hear me so much now. been through the worst of it and what we're getting now it's obviously it's gone round behind us we're just getting dragged along and it's gonna blow dry the car a bit they're like having a hairdryer on your hair if <laughs> you got it nice so this air dry this dryer that comes down now you would be tempted to go for the brake it says it do not brake it will raise itself automatically Got sensors on it. It's quite scary at first. Remember, so we're through most of it. Let these little towel things or wherever they are. Go across your car, don't be tempted to, to kind of uh, start the engine and drive off straight away because it's not finished. And I'm looking in the, my rear view mirror, I'm going to turn the engine on ready. So it's just gone through now, back into first gear and drive on. If you're worried that something's happened to your car, you could always pull up here and check your car out. And I mean, to be honest, I've never heard of anything happening to cars, they're usually quite good. And then we'll we'll have a look on the outside for what it's like. So the car's back now. And if I step back a little bit, it actually looks pretty good. If you look at the one of the wheels. It's not bad. Not muck, much muck on there because the car has not been cleaned for absolutely months, I have to say. So it looks for a pretty good job. Quite pleased with that actually. Yeah, and it only took a few minutes. So I, I hope you, you like this short video on uh, 
I'll, I'll clean my car using a car wash. If you do and you think it's helping you, it gives you an idea what to use and fantastic. And uh, watch out for my next video next week.